Hello everybody, this video is going to be slightly different because I'm going to be covering the Red Dead limited time unlocks. So basically you can get two items this week in Red Dead Online. Both of them aren't actually in the game or aren't in the game at the moment. I'm not sure if they've been in the game in the past because I haven't played it in so long. But the first thing you can get is the Porter's Jacket. What you need to do for that is complete any featured series whilst being in a Persistent Posse. Again, I don't know if you have to be the leader of the Persistent Posse. It just says be in a Persistent Posse. So perhaps you could just join someone who has one and then go into the featured series. As you can see, you go to Quick Join, Featured Series, go into what it is and complete it. This week it's Team Gunrush, it seems like. So as you can see in the background gameplay, I'm not very good. I haven't played Red Dead in some time. I didn't realize this was a free aim mode, it seems like. And I was trying to get an execution on that guy, but there's no excuse for the shots that I missed at the shotgun. And this guy just wouldn't die, and someone else ended up killing him. I did miss the second shot, even though I think it was blue and messed it up. Anyway, that's not the point of the video. The next unlock is the Benbow Jacket. And what you'll need to do to unlock it is complete either a moonshine sale or a trader sale. Now, I was going to do a moonshine sale for the gameplay, uh, but as you can see, I got impatient and tried going between a tram, and this ended up happening, completely destroying my wagon. Uh, so I ended up doing the trader mission, and then when I got to my trader camp, it wasn't full at all, so I couldn't even do a sale. So what I just did, if you're in the same situation, was just go grab a buck and wait about two minutes for the goods to go from zero to one, and then do a $2.50 sale, which is what I ended up doing. So I think that could be possibly the most profitable way of making money in the game, but I'm just kidding, obviously. Uh, so yeah, you need to complete those things in order to unlock these jackets, and you complete them before January 31st in order to get them. I'm not sure when they'll be deposited. It doesn't say anything about that. And also, the tweet is the only thing that says anything about these items. There's no mention of them in the newswire whatsoever, so it's pretty bizarre why they're unlocks. But it's nice to see Red Day getting some love, and there'll be a GTA video later today if there are any unlocks. At the moment, it's just a Nagasaki hoodie which just came out, so we'll just have to see with that, see if there's any cool new stuff. Anyway, I'll see you in a bit.